Hey, what's up guys? Happy Friday and welcome back to Lazy Couch Thoughts. Today's gonna be a little more laid back. Um, you might have saw the news, but Giants head coach Joe Judge apparently got into a very heated argument. And according to some sources, the players have dis disputed this, but we're gonna have some fun and just talk about this for, you know, why not? According to some people, he got into a fist fight with his offensive line coach and then fired him. And in case you didn't know who the Giants offensive line coach is, it's Mark Colombo. Yes, that former offensive tackle in the NFL, Cowboys tackle, six foot eight, 320 pounds, Mark Colombo. That's the guy that he chose to fist fight. And like, so if they fist fight, like he lost, right? Joe Judge had to lose. That is the fact that he's way smaller, and Joe and uh, Mark Colombo is just a you know a giant human being and like a straight up badass for being honest. You can't like the, if he if Joe Judge wins that fight, there's no way Mark Colombo gets fired, or if he wins the argument, there's no way because like you alpha him, so you're like, nah, yeah, you can stay now. You're gonna fall, like you're submitted. But like if you lose that fight, then like mm, one of my people under me can't be alpha over me. I got beat up, like. He's got to go. Like, could you imagine this at LSU? Could you imagine last year if Coach O and Joe Brady got into a fist fight? <laughs> could you imagine if Joe Brady would have gotten a fist fight with Sean Payton uh, back when he was an assistant? That's so crazy to think about. But anyways, let's get the measurements for these people because we're about to set up an MMA style fight. Okay, so apparently uh, Joe Judge doesn't have any height or weight. He's just like nothing. Like, it doesn't exist on the internet. This guy played at Mississippi State uh, in college. And I still can't find, I can't even find what he weighed, what position, what his height, anything in college. So, I don't know. I did some research. I saw pictures next to him and Bill Belichick. He looked to be about two or three inches taller than Bill. And Bill's 5'11". Let's just go 6'2". So he's six inches shorter. I would have to imagine that as an offensive tackle, I mean, homeboy's got some long arms too. He's probably down 10 inches of reach. And then you add in the fact that homeboy's 320. Hey, he's like, he's like my size. Like, Joe Judge is like, he's my size. He's not like, he's not a big muscle guy and he's not fat at all. Like, he's just, he's not a skinny guy, but I mean, he's, oh, guys, he would get white. And like, it had to have happened, right? Like, it, they had to, they had to have fist fought. Like, there's no reason why this would be a story. Nobody's getting fired over a screaming match after a win the day after a team wins the day after someone beats a division opponent to pull in a half a game of the or the division or of a game of the division that's whenever they have a screaming match and once when he gets fired no 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 something happened something's fishy here um Darius Slayton was on record telling Pat McAfee that that never happened that it's not true whatever they didn't fist fight bull I'm calling bull and I don't even know if I believe it I probably don't but you know what It'd be fun. It would be really fun to have your head coach and your offensive line coach fist fight at practice. He's you know who gets to go home early? Everybody on the team. You know who's not having practice late that day? Everybody on the team. Could you imagine that? Like, be, but you're like high school. Everybody's played some sport, even if it's in high school. Could you imagine like your head coach and one of the assistant coaches just like yelling at each other and them canceling practice? Now imagine just being professionals. Imagine making a million, millions of dollars playing football and all of a sudden you get to go home early because, oh, Coach Joe got in a fist fight, and like Joe Judge, like I believe he got in a fight because like the entire thing in training camp was he's making he's like we're gonna be the best condition. Uh, everybody runs laps. The coaches even have to run laps. Uh, they're they're always running laps. They all do Oklahoma drills. They only practice hitting. They only practice da 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 da. Like we're gonna be a tough physical football team, and even the coaches got to do this stuff. You tell me that's not the guy who's gonna fist fight one of his assistants at a practice? Yeah, okay, I'm believing that. Sure, whatever you say, bro. No, they got a fist fight, and honestly, I can't wait for the tape to come out because that's gonna be that's gonna be wild. Like, like, what do you think happened? Like, what do you think the what do you think the money line would have been to put on Joe Judge? Because like, he, I imagine he's a significant underdog, and like, they get back now. He got fired. He, he, you have to imagine he lost. But like, it would be a pretty boss move to like beat somebody up and then be like, all right, and you're fired. But at the same time, I guess it'd probably be more boss to beat somebody up and be like, all right, I'm gonna go get my coffee. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. What do y'all think? Just let me know in the comments, whatever. Just who do you think won the fight? Do you think it was a fight? And if you don't think it was a fight, tell me why you, you're lame. Like, did you not believe in Santa Claus as a kid? Like, whenever you're 15 or you're like, oh, Santa's not real. Like, yeah, I mean, who, who cares? Like, you know, he might not be real, but like, 
isn't it kind of fun to just choose to believe even though you know you know i don't know but that's pretty much gonna do it today i thought today was gonna be a little more fun laid back uh give everyone kind of a breather because we haven't really had fun one yet and this story was wild when i saw it come across uh twitter and a couple of other platforms but anyways so that's gonna wrap it up for today um if you enjoyed please like subscribe uh for more content just like this uh and comment your thoughts on the matter i, I think it'd be pretty fun to uh you know fantasize about these two coaches fighting <laughs> that's it and yeah that's gonna do it for me today see you guys next week peace